Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of My Mayhem. And another episode of Monster New Psychos, which is what I'm going to call my fans from now on. Today we're going to be looking at the Bell Song slash Butterfly Knife tutorial scene. So, this lets you know I'm not a pro, I'm not fluent in any of this stuff. It's just a hobby I've picked up. And I feel like it's an interesting scene, and I don't like, like to spread the word of it. So we're going to do a few tutorials on a few tricks. Um, probably three tricks that I know, and we're gonna do two tricks that are already made in one combo. I I am made. I don't know if it's already made, but it's just one I did while I was bored. So we're gonna start off with the standard opening. I'm gonna look a little bit like this. Um, basically, you wanna do this, but while your knife's going upward. You want to twist it with your two fingers so it lands like that. Then you want to flip that over. My knife has been unstable because it's broken at this time. So, yeah, time to do that. Making your knife look like it's doing this. And what I do is like, I don't know how I do it, but like, I do this, which stops right here, but. Different flows, we all have different flows, we make tricks look different. So our next trick is going to be the Y2K rollover. I had to move to a different location, a area of house more comfy, where I've done most of my practicing. It got on the bed, where this trick is called the Zen rollover, not the Y2K rollover, like I said in the last cut. Um, basically, you're going to have to do something called a thumb pass. Which is basically where you toss the knife around your thumb. Basically, you have to rotate your thumb and make it move around your thumb like this. You make the blade and safe handle go around, and you end up having to catch the safe handle while it's in motion. And then you do this, and and, and you have the safe handle, and just do any sort of like wrist pass. Usually, they do wrist pass, but you can do this into a standard opening if you want to. You can do like this, and then once you're in this position, you can like do that, or just pretty much any other trick you want to do. So, in slow motion, it's, it's in full motion, it should look. Fuck, what I meant to do in the last cut was this. There we go. There's another trick I've also just learned to do myself. I like to call it the ladder. I'm gonna move you guys back a little bit, okay? Basically, where you just flick it up, just do this. Let go, flick up, let go, flick up. And if you're a trainer, or just like if you're new to Battle Song, it's very good for letting you know, get your hand out the way of the blade. Because this, you make sure the blade, the blade does come close to your fingers. So it's very good for helping you learn to get your fingers out the way of the blade. Say if you're doing like a wrist pass. It just teaches you skills of catching the blade, learning about momentum, all that stuff. And basically, all you do is just flick the knife up. It goes up. Boom. Boom. And you can just repeat that motion over and over again. All you want. There's a point where you end up doing it so much that you just, just, just zone out. So, like, you could do this and this. Which I zone out doing a lot. Which is a standard opening. Remember it from before. But also, I'm doing this and then do this. Doing this opening. The so, um, letter. So, yeah. That's my tutorial for today. Not really much into the way of everything. But I hope it helps you with your learning battle song and all the other interesting hobbies that are out there. Are out there. So, goodbye. And stay crazy.